Have you ever pondered the possibility of an advanced civilization traversing the cosmos in search of a precious element? What if we told you that this civilization, the Anunnaki, journeyed to Earth for gold? Imagine a society so developed, so advanced, that they harnessed the power to venture across the cosmos. This is the story of the Anunnaki, as told in the ancient Sumerian texts. Born out of the cosmos on their home planet, Nibiru, the Anunnaki were a civilization far beyond us in terms of technological prowess. Their society was one of wonder and marvel, their knowledge of the universe profound, their technological capabilities nothing short of awe-inspiring. But even for the Anunnaki, survival was paramount. As their planet's atmosphere began to deteriorate, they were faced with a dire predicament. In this moment of desperation, they set their sights on a distant, blue planet, abundant in the very element they required to survive. As their planet's atmosphere deteriorated, they set their eyes on a blue planet rich in the very element they needed to survive, Earth. The Anunnaki, driven by desperation and survival, embarked on an interstellar journey to our planet. From the distant corners of the cosmos, these ancient beings set their sights on our blue and green sphere, drawn by the allure of a precious resource. Their home planet Nibiru was in dire straits. Its atmosphere was deteriorating and the solution they sought was none other than gold. This precious metal abundant on Earth was scarce on Nibiru, and the Anunnaki believed it to be the key to saving their dying planet. So they voyaged across the vast expanse of space, propelled by the urgency of their mission. They were not explorers or conquerors but refugees in search of salvation. Their journey, marked by immense challenges and uncertainty, was a testament to their sheer will and determination. Their destination, as the ancient texts suggest, was a region we now know as the Middle East. The fertile lands of Mesopotamia, rich with rivers and resources, became the Anunnaki's new home and the epicenter of their grand operation. Here, they hoped to extract the gold they so desperately needed to restore the atmosphere of Nibiru and ensure the survival of their race. And so the Earth became a beacon of hope for the Anunnaki, a solution to their impending doom. Upon arrival the Anunnaki wasted no time and initiated their gold mining operation. The scale of this operation was unlike anything Earth had seen before. It was vast, it was ambitious, and it was driven by an unyielding quest for the precious yellow metal. The Anunnaki, with their advanced technology, began mining gold at an astonishing rate. Imagine tools that could extract gold with such precision and efficiency that it would put our modern machinery to shame. Their technology was not just about brute force and speed, it was about finesse, it was about extracting every last particle of gold from the Earth's crust. And then there's the theory about us, humans. Some suggest that we were not just bystanders in this grand operation, we might have been part of it. The Anunnaki, so the story goes, might have created humans, designed us to be their assistants in this massive undertaking. It's a theory that challenges our understanding of our own origins, a theory that invites us to question who we truly are. This was not just about mining gold. This was a desperate quest, a testament to the Anunnaki's determination and their advanced capabilities. It was a mission that transformed the Earth, a mission that might have given birth to humanity as we know it. The Anunnaki's desperate quest for gold led to an unprecedented operation on the Blue Planet. The Anunnaki's quest for gold has left a profound impact on our planet and possibly on our species. This ancient civilization, believed by many to hail from a distant planet, sought the precious metal here on Earth. Their advanced technology and knowledge, a stark contrast to our primitive ancestors, allowed them to extract vast quantities of gold. Some theorists suggest that the Anunnaki's influence extended beyond mining. They posit that these extraterrestrial beings may have played a role in advancing human civilization itself, imparting knowledge and possibly even manipulating our genetic makeup. The departure of the Anunnaki, as mysteriously as their arrival, leaves us with more questions than answers. Did they simply exhaust Earth's gold supply, or was there a larger purpose for their visit, one that we are yet to comprehend? The Anunnaki's quest for gold, whether fact or fable, invites us to question our own history and the limitless possibilities of the cosmos.